All right, what's crack like in YouTube? Hope you guys are all having fun in quarantine. Today I'm gonna try something new, something I've never done before. As you guys are all sitting at home, locked up, probably super bored like I am. Now is the best time to try out a new hobby. Painting, crafts, blogs, YouTube channels, whatever you wanna do, honestly, as you are quarantined sitting at home, is it's the perfect time to try something out. So with that being said, I'm going to attempt my first time ever doing a DIY project. If you guys are new to the channel, my name is Bob Dabber. I'm a full-time teacher, part-time reseller. And now that the school has been canceled because of the virus, I have all this time on my hands and I'm just trying to not be bored all day long. Uh, as a reseller, I go to the bins a lot. Sometimes I pick the stuff up from the bins that has stains on it or whatnot, maybe a hole here and there that I didn't know about. And like for the last five months, I've been throwing things in a corner in my laundry room of things I want to bleach, dye. Now keep in mind, I've never bleached, dyed anything. I've barely, <laughs> barely ever tie dyed anything. And I'm not looking up any tutorials or anything. Like how hard can it be? You just put bleach on your shirt and different patterns and then it turns out how you want it to. Let me go over my little supply list. So I got a $1 squirt bottle. This is what I'm gonna use to apply the bleach. I have the bleach. I'm gonna make my own little concoction here with water and bleach, probably like a splash of bleach and a lot of water. I don't know how much bleach you actually need. I do not have any gloves, so I'm gonna be very meticulous as I pour out the bleach or apply the bleach. You don't want it on your fingers and you definitely don't want it in your eyes. And I guess the last thing I have to show you are the articles of items that I'm going to splash some bleach on. I have no clue how this is going to work out. I'm putting on an old crew neck sweatshirt that I don't care if I accidentally spill some bleach on just to be safe. And yeah, I guess let's just go for it. Um, off to the bathroom we go. I'm going to do all of this nonsense in my bathtub because I don't think, welcome to my disgusting bathroom. Hey, by the way, Louie, if this video gets a hundred, hundred likes, I will tie dye Louie. Huh. Just kidding. All right, wow, this is very weird filming in a bathroom, but I have my little concoction made up about this much bleach, about that much water. I don't know. This is, like I said, it's my first time ever doing this. I did realize, however, nine items is too many to do because I think I'm gonna need somewhere to like hang them. So I'm going to just do, I think maybe three or four items. I'm gonna do the Carhartt, the long sleeve Carhartt that has a couple stains. I'm gonna maybe do the Chiefs that has a bunch of stains on it. And I definitely wanna do this Disney World or Disneyland crew neck. And then I'll try out the, uh, the rugby because why not? So I guess the rest of this I will do at a later date. Maybe, if this all turns out. You guys really won't be able to see what I'm doing that well, so let me explain before I dive into it. This has a lot of yellowing on the sleeves and on the lower half of the sweatshirt. So that's what I'm gonna spray down. Here we go. <laughs> So I decided to use a spray bottle because I thought it'd give like a cooler look to it. Like the spots you spray more will be more bleached than the, the weak spots. This sweatshirt already has like a cool acid wash print to it. So I'm very curious to see how this is gonna turn out. I already see some of the color coming out of this. So I don't really know where to go from this point. Am I supposed to like wash it? 
Or do I let it dry first? Oh my gosh, this bleach is strong. It's hurting my eyes. I'm gonna just breeze through the next ones. So this long sleeve car hurt has a couple stains on the front. So I'm just gonna, I think on this one, that one I kind of went bottom up. This one, I'm just gonna do like stripes all the way across and I don't know, just see how it looks. All right, I don't know. If you're still watching this crap video, um, this is all to be creative. Try something new, you're stuck at home, be artsy, be crafty, make something. Okay, we'll do the rugby next. This thing is super yellowed, super stained, but it was a very cool looking rugby, so I had to pick it up. And so we're just gonna do spots. Actually, you know what? On this one, I'm just gonna leave it here on the bottom of the tub to soak up all of the excess bleach and do this one next. So this crew neck is very stained up. It has a black tint to it all over the place. So on this one, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to manipulate my own tie dye and just kind of spray a swirl onto it. I'm very curious to see how all this turns out. Here goes nothing. Okay, yeah, that's not gonna work, I can already tell you that. My eyes are burning from this bleach. I might have used too much. I'm gonna just do the same thing. Give it a nice, just very light spray down from way back here. Ugh, it's turning it like brown. And it looks like I'm almost out of solution here. All right, I'm done, my eyes hurt. All right, at this point, I don't really know what I am supposed to do with the bleached items. By the way, if you're gonna do this, you definitely need gloves and uh, you need a fan going because I was getting gassed out in there. So yeah, I'm just gonna wing it. I'm gonna wash like the excess bleach out of the shirts in the tub and then I'm gonna throw them on a rinse cycle in the washing machine. I might even do like two rinse cycles in the washing machine and then throw them in the dryer and then they should be done, right? I, I guess we'll find out. Okay, YouTube, I am gonna do a little fashion show. I'm gonna use my tall, lanky body to show off my four uh, bleach dye shirts that I made. You know, at the end of the day, I was creative. I tried something new. I eliminated some boredom, got rid of some clothes that have been sitting in my laundry room. Um, it burned like an hour and a half, so it was worth it in the end. I'm gonna show you all four of the shirts. I didn't really know what I was expecting, but... <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, you guys be the judge. Let me know if you like them. This is still a reselling channel. It's just gone astray with this quarantine stuff. But yeah, let me know if you like the stuff. In my own personal opinion, I don't think I used enough bleach. It doesn't really look like it's been bleach dyed. It just kind of looks like it's stained. <laughs> like the video, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. And I'll see you guys on the next one and enjoy these shirts.